hey my miracles welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome to my channel i'm so happy that you're here and i hope you hit that subscribe button and join the family so in today's video we are going to be talking about me being allergic to lash glue yes girl lash glue like i cannot believe it so let's go ahead and get started so I'm going to be telling you all about my journey of how I found out I was allergic to lash glue. So I recently did a video, I will link it in the description, where I just started breaking out like my eyes. I started getting blepharitis so bad where my eyes were so, so red, puffy. At times it would get flaky and it was just getting crazy, okay? I've always known that I have allergic reactions to certain makeups, right? And like I threw away so much makeup and I went to the dermatologist and they said, yes, let's do a patch test. We're gonna check with your insurance and then we'll call you back and set it up. Well, girl, it's been like three or four weeks and they still haven't called me. And I guess I could have called too, but I was like, you know what, let me just, trial and error like every day let's try to figure out what it is so i started doing my research and i saw a lot of girls talking about you know they did their makeup routine every day regular and all of a sudden one day it just wasn't working anymore and they were de um, developing blepharitis too blepharitis is what it's called when your eyes get really red and you're having an allergic reaction to something and um so I did also start using these wipes and these help so much. They are a little pricey, but they help so much. After I take off my makeup, I always clean my eyes with this and it works amazing. They do have an allergy one, but this one works better for me. I found this glue. So it says super strong hold eyelash adhesive. It says um, waterproof safe on skin and it says formaldehyde free and latex free. So those two things from all the research that I've done um, is what really breaks people out. The latex and the formaldehyde. So this is by I Envy by Kiss. So I found this one on walmart.com. This one is actually a little bit harder to find, but like I said, I did find it on walmart.com. Um, I think it's like a third vendor because it doesn't say like ship by Walmart. It says ship by, and then it's like, it was another little store. But this was my savior. This has helped me to stop breaking out. My eyes now are just so much more sensitive. And again, I don't know why. Like even last night, I was crying and I woke up and my eyes were so swollen. And yes, everything's okay. You know, sometimes you just get overwhelmed, but you know. And this has been amazing for me. So I definitely recommend for you to try it. And then, so now I'm just trying to make sure like makeup or anything that I put on my eyes does not have either one of these two, formaldehyde or latex. Um, and it was affordable. I think it was like $8, but how much is usually eye glue or is that a little bit more? I don't remember, but I'll insert the price right here. And, um, another thing. So I was like, okay, so I should be good to try all my regular makeup on, right? Well, another thing I would faithfully use the elf eyeliner. And when I used it one day, like it broke me out. I didn't use like eyelash glue. I literally just did my makeup like I had been doing it. That was not breaking me out. And I used the e.l.f. eyeliner. It was a brand new one and it broke me out. So I don't know if I just like developed an allergy. Right now I'm wearing a Revlon eyeliner. I will insert it. So I'm just trying to be more careful of the makeup that I'm using. Even if it says hypoallergenic, it can still break you out. So don't think just because some makeup says hypoallergenic that it's not going to break you out. Look at the ingredients. So now I'm just, you know, being more cautious. But yeah, so I definitely wanted to tell you all what I found out that was making my eyes get an allergic reaction. It was my eyeliner so far and my lash glue. So again, I definitely recommend this glue. Just screenshot that and look for that glue. This really helped me. So if you're having an issue with that, it may be your eyelash glue. And like I said, for me, it was the glue and the eyeliner. 
but um that like i said that revlon eyeliner i've been using has been working great so i do hope this video was helpful to somebody out there because i know for me it was hard like i love makeup and i want to wear my makeup you know but i don't want to have this allergic reaction every time that i do so i hope this video helped one of y'all don't forget to hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you have not already remember to pray psalm 91 the prayer of protection i love you guys god bless you and i'll see you on the next one